Right, this is Walton Gorday now, St Paul's Church. And um, Walton in Gorday now it's called. So I've just come to have a look inside, it's very welcoming. It welcomes you in this place, straight away. I'll just go outside and come back in again so that I can get the, the video done. Doesn't look that old. There's probably on the site of an earlier church, I expect. But that's more likely. It was on the site of an earlier church. And, um... Massive, isn't it? It's got almost like a Methodist feel to it. Fine old organ there, look. Marjorie Bedell. And they do refurbish that. Like I said, it's probably built on the site of a very old church. It's very basic, isn't it? But very bright. Very, it's a bit more like a barn, really. Proper font though, that don't look young. The ceiling's amazing, isn't it? Very hippie. Very hippie. St Paul's Church, Walton in Gordano. Peace for all, love in our lives. It's pretty, isn't it, as well? Give, is, give us this day our daily bread. A little bassina there, look, and the bread, doing the bread and the wine, look. They just leave it lying about, don't they? <gasps> uh. Maybe they get the cross out later. That's even that's open as a welcoming sign. Oh, full of things. Nice solid roof. Yeah, like I said, it feels like a big barn. Sort of the feeling, sort of feeling I've got of it. Right, I might come in in a minute and do a photo. I'm just going to go and have a wander outside again. I've got two other Gordano type churches to do in a minute. It was at All Saints in Clevedon a minute ago, which had a spire, a small spire. Yeah. Of course, as I was cycling here, I realised what those hills were, where the M5 is carved into the motorway over there. 
which I've only ever seen this valley from the motorway. I've never explored it. I've only ever seen it when I've been zooming along up in the hills in the motorway. High up there, the motorway is halfway up that hill. The M5 runs. And if we go follow up over that way, if this road past the church follows on up, you come, you'll come to the seafront area. You can cycle along that bit and have a nice view as well. I'm just doing what I can. It's probably going on for about three o'clock now, you see. I set out later today. But it's set in a lovely, lovely setting. I'm looking for a grave, graves of anyone I might be of use um, to somebody, but I haven't come across it yet. But I did help a lady out at the last churchyard finding um, trip and um, gold graves. I found her too when I was there. And um, her mother was, um, I think, born born in um, Bridgewater, was christened at St Mary's with a tall spire. Yeah, so there we go, that's...